Hello, YouTube. Nina Jun here, and welcome back to. Let me change this. Yes, we're reacting to more Love Live songs, specifically Nijigasaki Kaku and School Idol Dokokai. At this at this point, I I can, you dude, I got it, I got it. So we're gonna be listening to the other three, the other trio. I, I, I was about to say Kanata, I, Emma, and then Rina. I. Let's just get straight into this. One, two, three, go. Wait, the volume was very low. <laughs> Again, I'm sorry, I can wait. Yeah, let me just. Okay, one, two, three, go. Asaga kite. It's so loud now. Afuretada. Hashini daso. I like her little like. Ooh, I like the fact that like she starts. Oh, high five. Hey, hey, hey. Hello. I like how she starts all like gentle and stuff, and then she just breaks off. This is why I love her song. I had to listen to their songs again, so I I listened to the TV size version. I didn't listen to the full version, but oh my god, I it reminded me of how hype I song was. Same with Rina and like Emma Emma's song as well. Ega oga. I love I love eyes. Oh, we're gonna talk about eyes after like later on. Twenty four seven. <laughs> the freaking twenty four seven. <laughs> this is where it gets hype. <laughs> That's the freaking freaking puns. Hello, Karan. Mita iya. Yo, the fact that she wants to be the sun. Oh my god. She, cause this for her character, like she's not. Like it's, I'll get to it later. <laughs> oh, she's trying to connect with the with the with the listeners. Oh my god, because she's trying to find herself. So it's like different from the others who are trying to hide their their selves. Very different. Very different. She's that other category. Nina. It, it's especially the case because she's like that outgoing person who can pretty much do almost everything. I don't know about her studies, but like sports wise, I think she's she's like smart as well. <laughs> My headphones are like moving back and forth. Hello, hello, hello. Mise Takayo. Wow. Dude, am I am I gonna get up? I, I'm so close to getting up. I swear to God, if this bridge, I got up. I got up. I got up. I had to get up. I had to get up for that. Yo! Oh my God. Her song is so, and I I love this kind of upbeat, energetic song. Forget about that. Oh my god, the hype. Taiyo, so my girl, I am. Ah. Oh, I thought she said I, but it's ah. Yo, what a te causa eco. Oh my god, even that is like a pun cuz I Hello, hello. Ka 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 ka. Ka ka ka. Oh my god. Yay! <laughs> I love you. I love you. I I I Oh my god. Her song.
song. So what I was so when it comes to like the categories that I've stated in the other videos, she is blatantly in the latter category of like trying to find herself. The other the other girls they're trying they were hiding themselves. We see Ayumu doing that. Kasumi was like she she's that awkward like middle person who who's not trying to hide herself. She know and but then then again she also knows herself. She's more of the type that's bettering herself is the case. So the three official like different the three cases are basically one the type to hide themselves, the the middle one which is like trying to f better themselves and then the third one is trying to find themselves. I is in that third category where she's trying to find who or what kind of like idol she wants to be especially for her for her freaking episode you could see that clearly because her personality wise like she it's kind of it's not like Setsuna it's definitely not, like what I wanted to say was like in relation to Setsuna like how she follows the rules especially you can see that when she's like um helping like the sports teams and stuff like that they have a set of rules that's why that's that's what I loved about their focus when it came to her episode because she because she's the all the all outgoing girl like sports sports like going helping for helping with sports la de la da but then the fact that she was confused on like what what kind of idol she should be was so touching it and then the song itself like it's it's not like one of those deep like deep meaning songs it's just a straightforward like she wants to give a smile like be it through like she wants to have fun with all of us and she wants all of us to be like happy smiling and just like go all out going like the sun and just like keep smiling and smile and wave boss smile and wave <laughs> just basically be like pe and she just wants to be she just wants to be the sun for base for all of us and just give brightness it's just so that's that's the idol she wants to strive to be she wants she's striving to be that kind of idol where she's like giving smiles to everyone that's it's a beautiful concept very beautiful concept one thing i would like to state is that what's what's interesting about her song and rena's song was that f for some reason all the songs so far have been english I even the ones up to like cut in for some reason, for some very odd reason, I thought it was I thought it was gonna be a trend, but for some weird odd reason, Aisan and Rina are the only ones that have it in like kata, katakana, right? No, okay, well, yeah, yeah, kata, yeah, it's katakana. So they have it in katakana. Essentially, all of the idols so far have their songs in like a English kind of format which was very strange well Emma obviously is not it's, that's that's not that's not English but like it's a it's not you know it's not Japanese is what I'm trying to say I pretty sure La Belle La Bella Patria I don't know I don't because I don't think it's is it French no yes what French is it oh actually no I'm I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna cut that out. But yeah. <laughs> but yeah, that's what I wanted to say about I. I is that third category where she just wants to. She's trying. She's finding herself out, and it's just beautiful. And the fact that her and Rina are the only ones who have katakana is so damn gay. I ship them so much, and I'll see you in the next episode. Ciao.